so i'm just doing this video as a review for these antennas well they're very long you know i'll but test them on low power very very low power just to tune them properly with a 1.0 swr i can say 1.1 there about and i just want to just take my attention to this this is tested and i've been using this for some time but i ran into a problem and the solder here came off slightly and i lost some power so i took it down uh, so I'm just reviewing this which is a jip hole uh, if you look you can see that it is very tall right it is very tall and not much persons would use this in the FM band as this is about seven feet and most persons use these antennas for ham radio well the reason why i'm using this antenna it is like a two-in-one antenna so this is it right here and it is very very long the idea here is this antenna it has a quarter wave section which is that section there this section here is the half wave so this is what makes this antenna so powerful and so ideal if you are below the average terrain or if you're in a valley which i am in that situation so this thing is very long and if you look you have to screw it on there it is long I tell you, it's very long what I'm saying is that my experience using this is that it generate a very very clean song it's very enhancing as well also this jip will eliminate the dead spot where other antennas may not be able to reach probably behind a little hill it completely diminish to use this antenna i i'm just giving you my experience and just giving you a review so you can look into this i'm saying this antenna what happened is that it have a high takeoff on the j side so yeah so subscribe comment in the comment section and let me know what's happening yeah i've been using this in the fm band testing and just because of the problem there i took it down so yeah let me know in the comment section i'm lens and i'm out